A cold? Yeah. Just as well, too. When you blacked out, you were on your way to becoming a pile of ash. <sighs> Shion's the reason you're still here. Shion? You've healed me? In case you'd forgotten, we've still got four lords to defeat. You dying would have only slowed things down. What about Balsef's troops? We've got them on the ropes. While you've been getting your beauty sleep, most of the remaining Renans have either surrendered or fled. You slaying Balsef was the catalyst we'd been waiting for. Thanks to you, Galagli is finally free. You have my gratitude. We couldn't have done it without you. I just did what anyone would have done. Iron Matt. Forgive me. Alfin. It's good to finally see who I'm speaking to. <sighs> Half of him, anyway. So, feel like telling us who you used to be? I... I wish I could. Memory's still giving you grief, eh? I see. Still, no sense in beating yourself up. You've remembered your name. The rest will come in time. So, what happens now? Oh, just everything. The realm may be liberated, but we're still destitute. You name it, anything and everything starts from scratch. But enough of that. You've just woken up. You should get a sense of the scale of what you've accomplished. Head over to the Gates of Fire, and take a look at the view. It's a sight too many Danans died only ever seeing in their dreams. The Gates of Fire. I'll be your chaperone. Last thing we need is you tripping on a pebble and missing another week. Remind me to laugh next time. I wonder if something happened. I feel like somebody's watching us. Maybe there's someone around here who needs our help. <laughs> this is... Yeah. What? Uh. 
Shion, why do you keep people at arm's length? <laughs> You're always trying to wave it off whenever someone's nice to you. Like with Tilsa just now, why couldn't you just accept her gratitude? Our interests just happen to overlap. I don't want people thinking I'm doing things to be nice when in reality they benefit both of us. All I care about is that we hurry up and defeat the Lords. See? That's what I mean! <laughs> you want to defeat the Lords. I may have been skeptical at first, but now I really believe you meant it. Yet despite that, you still took the time to help out those injured Danans, didn't you? I did it because it was necessary and I got roped into helping out. Is that the same reason you helped that kid in Balsif's castle? Because it sure didn't look that way to me. <sighs> You've helped me too. Not just with my injuries, but by being there for me as well. Even though I can't feel pain, the injuries I get from using the Blazing Sword could probably kill me. That thought alone should be terrifying. But I know you'll always be there by my side, ready to heal me. It's because of you that I can wield the Blazing Sword! like that <laughs> if you get any closer you're going to set off my thorns you know uh, I was just trying to compliment you you were <gasps> what now Sion your thorns it's okay I'll stop talking about it. You... you will? In any case, I'm just glad that you're the one who ended up with the Master Core. Thank you, Xion, for everything. <sighs> now let's go check out those Gates of Fire. Really? I swear. You're bad for the heart. Okay, off we go. I don't see any soldiers or their pet zoogles. Just strays roaming around. They must have split once... Balsif kicked the bucket and they had nobody left to obey. Dispose of the trash. That gun of yours is real up. handy in a pinch. It takes a true marksman to use. Well, can't think of it. 
Looks like it could be worth something. That monster that appeared from the spirit vessel, and the power inside the blazing sword, they're both born of the same thing. It's all astral energy harvested from the souls of dying Danans. I suppose so. Then it was the Danans who gave their lives for today. Their power. After all this time, it's what finally destroyed Balsif and his wall. By the way, what happened to all the energy that we released? It's dispersing and spreading across Dana as we speak, finding its way back to where it belongs. And all the energy the Renans have harvested? Where does that go? One Sovereign's decided, I mean. I'd wager they don't give it back, right? <laughs> what? Can't tell the Dan in that? Or about why you want to kill all the lords? Oh, like you don't have anything to hide? The Blazing Sword. It's powered by the burning astral energy of the Master Core I possess. So why don't you explain how it manifested into the shape of that beast, hmm? Just how did you manage that? How am I supposed to know? My memory's a complete blank, remember? <sighs> <sighs> Fine, be that way. It's not like we ever trusted each other any- She's still not awake? Not yet. Her injuries aren't serious, but she's severely weakened. Must have been quite a fight. There's nothing we can give her? If only. What with the beatings we've taken lately, we're barely getting by on the little provisions we have as it is. That bad, huh? If there are no supplies here, then... That's it. We need Doc. Doc? The same Doc that took care of you? Yeah. He's back in Mosgul. If anyone can help us, it's him. In that case, would you mind asking for us? I'd go myself, but I'm tied up here for now. Not a problem. Leave it to me. You see anybody around here who could use our help? We can't chase after every little thing. Nice. Hmm. Got it. Yes!
so quiet. From now on, no one is going to be whipped or killed here ever again. Hey there, Doc. Hmm? Who are you? It's me, Iron Mask. Though these days I go by Alfin. I finally remembered my name. Alfin? I heard that was the guy who brought down Balsif. Wait. You're telling me you're the liberator of Calaglia? Our own Iron Mask? Of all the people. I told you, I'm Alfin now. And I didn't overthrow Balsef alone. Even so, that's no small feat you've accomplished. And you managed to get your face back, too. That woman with you, the Renin? You know about her. Only what I've heard from rumors. I wasn't sure I believed it. But now I suppose I must. Doc, she... Thank you. You sure you should be saying that to a Renin? I'm not saying it to any old Renin. I'm saying it to you, young lady. I only helped because it was in my interests as well. Of course, I would imagine as much. But that doesn't change the end result. The two of you defeated Balsef, and now all of us are free. That is a fact. Thanks, Doc. I should be the one thanking you. I'll never be able to repay what you two have done. Anyway, I'm guessing you didn't come here just to catch up. Uh, right. We need your advice. We found a girl who's collapsed from exhaustion, and she needs medicine. Do you know anything that could help? Hmm. If she's that weak, she may need a nutritional boost. The herbs I have here won't be enough. Oh! Have you tried searching Kirt Garrison? No. We passed it on our way here, but... With all the Renin soldiers gone, that place should be empty now. If we're lucky, maybe they left something you can use. Good idea. We'll take a look. Kirt Garrison. If I'm not mistaken, that's located off to the side of the railroad tracks. Wherever it is, just make it quick. You look happy. Do I? I guess I am. Getting thanked for everything by someone I actually know? It made it really hit home that we made a difference. That guy's a strange one, though. Doc? I don't think he's that odd. He is, though. He thanked me, a Renan, for helping. Despite everything my people have put him through over the years. He's free now. He doesn't have to act nice around my con- He's not acting. He means it. And like he said before, he was thanking you as an individual, Xion, not just some Renin. That's what makes it so strange. Would you have preferred he yelled and threw rocks at you? I'm not saying that. It's just hard for me to understand him. <sighs> We've reached our destination. What's this thing? Out of our way! Swallow blade! Here Spirit I come! Swallow blade! Strike! Help me! This could be useful.
Looks like this place opens out into the ocean. The water is so much cleaner than what's on the surface. I even see fish swimming around. Yeah, and boy, do they look delicious. What? N never mind. This could be useful. No choice. Slut! Searing flame! Reload! You're finished! Magna Ray! Rising Wyvern! You're on! Strike! Slut! We're in good form! Like this should be easy. Magna Ray! Light hits on! Mirage! Here I go! Ignite! Go! I'm only getting Searing Flame! Reload! Here I come! Swallow Blade! Our work is done here. Let's move. I'm right behind you, Shion. Think this is it? How would I know? It matches the description we were given, at least. No use standing around here hemming and hawing. Let's take it back and see. I hope you're right. There's no way I'm coming all the way back here. Just to be safe, I think before we head back to Ulzebek, we should maybe have Doc double-check this is the right stuff. All right, but let's make it quick. Give you swallow blade. Searing flame. Reload. Slash. Rising wyvern. Again. Mega Here light. I come. We're in good form.
Did you find anything useful? We think this might work, but we wanted you to take a look at it first. Let's see. Ah, this stuff. Yes, this'll work. I'd hurry over and give it to the girl right away. Right. Then we'll do that now. Say, Iron Mask. No, sorry. It's Alfin now, right? Are you and that young woman planning to stick together moving forward? Uh, yeah. I think so. Hmm. I see. You know, I think things just might be starting to change. What do you mean? I'm not sure of that myself. But I feel like after being stalled for a long time, the gears of progress are finally starting to turn again. I imagine people are going to have things to say about the two of you. But you simply keep doing what you feel is right. If you ever get tired and need to rest, feel free to come back here. Until then, Take care of yourself. Thanks, Doc. Off we go. See anybody around here who could use our help? We can't chase after every little thing. Is this what you asked for? Perfect. That'll do nicely. I had a feeling you'd come through for us. With this, the little one should be right as rain in no time. I can't believe it. Not often we get visitors from Cislodia around here. Cislodia? Calaglia's neighbor. One of the five realms. What with that wall in the way, I guess it's not surprising. But I've never actually met someone from the outside world before. Up till now, the only time the gates ever opened was to let Renan convoy units in and out. No one ever thought to stow away and hitch a ride out? This place might be a living hell, but when next door is a living hell too, you start thinking it doesn't matter much one way or the other. So you're Rinwell, and you're with the Cislodian Resistance known as the Silver Swords. Your organization sent a group of you to establish contact, but you're the only one who made it through. That sound about right? Lately, our people's oppression has become more and more severe. When we heard rumors that you had staged a successful rebellion in Calaglia, 
We hoped that maybe you could help us. News sure gets around quickly, huh? If you ask me, it's awfully convenient she just happened to show up now. Certainly raises a lot of red flags. Please, I swear it's true! My people are dying! I risked my life trying to get here so I could find help. It's okay. You did well. We'll take it from here. <laughs> Hold on, Zephyr. You're not really thinking... We'll join her. Alfin, start getting ready. I let you use the Blazing Sword, and we work together to overthrow the Lords. That was the deal, remember? Wait, is that a Renan? What is this? Take it easy. It's complicated, but she's on our side. She helped to find some medicine for you. She did? But no, she's a... I, I can't believe it. The Renans from other realms could attack at any time. That's for you all to worry about. I've got bigger fish to fry. That sword of Alfin's is our best weapon. We can't just go lending him to other lands. Even if you keep him here, the blade's as good as useless without me on board. And what makes you think I can't persuade you, Bright Eyes? What makes you think you can? Last I checked, you couldn't even touch me. Enough! Alfin, what do you want to do? I... I know all too well the hardships the slaves of this realm had to endure. That's why I took up the sword. To help them. If Danans are being oppressed in other realms, then... And I have to help them, too. Nath has a point. We can't discount the possibility of further attacks. But now, our struggle has grown. It's become much larger than just liberating the people of Calaglia. We can't be in two places at once, Zephyr. True. Which means we're limited in our options. We play this the same way we did with Balsef. I have a bad feeling about this. You and me both, but it's too late for regrets. Jeez, really? You don't say. So, you're really going, huh? Just the four of you? Uh, afraid so. Look after the place while we're away. <laughs> Always the smooth talker. We'll do what we can to hold down the fort. We've got the Renans to keep us busy. Good luck. Just remember. Yeah, yeah, don't go killing anyone without good reason. I get it. I'm not about to repeat what they did. Let's move, people. I need something to eat. <laughs> 